So someone asked me, how do you figure out what number comes next in this pattern? 2, 9, 28, 65. So what, what number would end up being next in the pattern? Usually what I'll do with these, I'll try to figure out what's the difference between these numbers here. Maybe find a pattern. So 2 plus 7 is 9. 9 plus 19 is 28. 28 plus 37, that's 65. And I don't really see much of a a pattern here. So maybe we're doing something to each individual number. So that's a good thing to try as well. So next I'm trying to look at maybe the numbers themselves. Are they close to some other number that's similar? For example, 64. 8 times 8 is 64. So 8 squared is 64. Or 4 to the third power, that would be 64. And 28, that's close to 27. And 3 to the third power, 3 times 3 times 3 3, that would give us 27. So, so 1 to the third power is 1 plus 1. That would give me 2. Here, 2 to the third power, that gives me 8 plus 1. That would give me 9. So that would work. 3 to the third power is 27 plus 1. That would give me 28. I think this is working. And then 4 to the third power, we said that was 64. 64 plus 1 equals 65. So we would expect, if we followed this pattern here, 5 to the third power plus 1. 5 times 5 is 25. 25 times 5 is 125 plus 1, so 126. So we'd expect this next number to be 126 if it follows this pattern here. And this does seem like it's the pattern. It's a really good match. So the next would be 6 to the third power plus 1, and that would equal some number as well. So really, that's the way I've approached it. I think I was kind of lucky seeing this. I was looking at a similar pattern that had cubes in it earlier, and that's what kind of made me look at this here. Either way, that's how you figure out what number comes next in this sequence, 2, 9, 28, and 65. If you have another way to figure this out, leave a comment. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.